Hi everyone, I'm Kim Goyette, and I am so glad you're joining me here for yoga today. Whether you had a big meal after a holiday celebration, or you just want to maintain good health, keeping your gut healthy is a key element to your overall well-being. We're going to be focusing on revving up our metabolism as well as rinning out any of the toxins in our body so that our gut stays healthy and you can stay happy and free. Let's get started. Yoga for everybody with meditation mother. So we're going to start just by lengthening our sides and creating some space in our midsection so that we can move that energy around. So sitting up nice and tall, you can grab onto your knees and allow that leverage on your knees. Lift your belly up towards your chest. Notice the lengthening of the sides. Keep that length through the crown of the head and then plant your fingertips over to the side. We're going to open up the ribs and the side body so that we can create some space for the organs and the gut. Let's take the left arm straight up and then take it over to the side. Give a nice squeeze, opening up anything on the left side. Taking a deep breath in, really lengthening the side body. And then exhale, release all the way down. Let's try the other side, reaching up and take it over to the side. Good, expand the ribs, take a nice inhale here and exhale release both arms raise up towards the sky maybe lifting the chin a little bit reach the fingertips really ground down with your seat as you lift your low belly up towards your ribs and your ribs lift up towards the sky we're going to turn our whole body towards the right and then drop the hands down and allow the arms to fold over and start to fold over that leg Good, just getting a nice squeeze on the right side. Relax the back of the neck. Good, kind of wringing out any toxins within this gentle twist and a little bit of compression. And then coming back to center and we're gonna turn our whole body over to the left, drop the hands down outside of the left knee and then drop the chin towards the chest, relax the back of the neck. And again, get that little squeeze. Good, come back to center. This time we're gonna bring our hands out in front and fold forward, so allowing our gut to compress. Relax the back of the neck. Take a few breaths into the back body, some healthy compression in the front body. And then walking the hands in. Good. So now we're going to work on a breath that will help to stimulate your metabolism, get that fire going within. When we have a healthy, balanced fire, we can metabolize all the food so that it can turn into nutrition for our body and we eliminate all the junk that we don't need. So we're going to do a breath of fire. A breath of fire is a quick breath out the nose. It's very quick. And as we exhale out the nose, we're going to pump the belly. So we're drawing energy from the ground in and up, kind of pumping and flaming or filling that flame within the body. And so it looks a little bit like this. So keep your eyes open for a second. It's a quick breath out the nose with a drawing in of the belly, in and up, in and up. And if you don't get it right away, don't worry, just fake it till you make it. We're gonna do about 30 of those, then we'll hold the exhale, depleting anything that's within the body. Fold forward to give that extra squeeze, get all the junk out, and then a deep breath up, and we'll do a round of three. So gently close the eyes, and we'll just start with that quick breath and the pumping of the belly. Exhale fully, fold forward, squeeze all the junk out, pause, and then inhale all the way up. Exhale out the mouth, relax the shoulders. Let's do it again, quick breath. Good. 
Deep exhale, fold forward, squeezing all the residual junk out. Deep inhale all the way up. Exhale out the mouth. Let's do it one more time, quick breath. Big exhale. Good, folding forward, hold that exhale. Hold, hold, deep breath all the way up. And exhale. Good, close the eyes and just notice any warmth within the belly. Really turning on your metabolism, getting things moving within the gut. And let's open the eyes. We're gonna come to hands and knees. We're gonna do a few cat cows just to, again, get some movement within the body. So hands underneath the shoulders. We'll lift the face, drop the belly, lift the tailbone, and then push in, really draw your gut, your navel in towards the spine, round in. Look at your belly, relax the back of the neck. Stay here and draw the belly in a little bit more, maybe like a clenching right at the gut, and then gently drop the belly back to neutral. Let's do it again. So inhale, lift the tailbone, lift the face. Exhale, push into the hands. Rounding in, draw your belly in and up. Maybe one more fraction of an inch. Good, and then back to a neutral spine. Nice, and then just kind of move from side to side. Relax your head, opening up the side. Great, let's come to seated again. This time we're gonna do a little bit of compression in the side so that we can really work with the ascending colon on the left side and the descending colon on the right side. So we'll take our left leg out to the side, sit up nice and tall. We're gonna plant our hand out to behind the leg. You can bring your hand to your hip or to your shoulder and just take it over, get a nice squeeze there. So we work with the ascending colon first because that's the route of digestion. So the food moves up, over, down, and out. And that's how we wanna work with that natural process. Good, come back to center. And we're gonna unwind, just moving towards the opposite leg for a moment. Good, come back to center and let's bring that left leg in, right leg out. Good, take it over, plant the hands, bring your hand to your shoulder and take it over to the side. Good, get a nice squeeze in the right side. And then coming back to center, slowly unwind. Good, bring both legs back in, and we'll take it all the way down onto our back. So grab onto the backs of the thighs and slowly lower down. Plant the feet, hug the knees into the chest, grab one hand on each knee and just draw the knees into the chest for a moment. Rock from side to side, massage your low back. Good, and then come back to center. Hug the left knee into the chest, lengthen the right leg all the way down. So again, we're working with the ascending colon first, giving a little bit of a squeeze to move food up. And then we'll move it over and down. Good. Let's take this left knee, cross it across the body and allow the leg to fall towards the earth. Don't worry about that left shoulder coming up. Your chest and head can face towards the sky and just allow your body to relax in this twist. Take one more deep breath here and bringing the knee back towards center. Let's allow that leg to extend all the way down and hug the right knee into the chest. Give yourself a nice hug again. A little squeeze on the right side stimulates the descending colon. And then let's cross that knee across the body. Let that leg rest all the way down towards the earth. Again, that right shoulder might come off the ground. That's okay. Letting your body soften. 
Letting go of any gripping in the belly. And bring the knee back to center. Plant both feet, shift your hips back to center. And then we're gonna extend the legs all the way down below and give ourselves a little massage. So we're gonna massage with digestion. Starting at the lower left side of the body, we're going to cross that body, we're going to cross the hands down across the low belly. So just giving a little bit of a compression sweep and then coming up the right side of the body. Good. And then going across and all the way down. Good. Going across and up across and down and out good so bringing that digestion up on the right side across and then down the left you got it and then just relaxing into shavasana so the best form of digestion is rest and digest so just softening into the space Relaxing the throat. And releasing any tension in the low belly. We're just taking a couple of breaths here. And let's hug the knees into the chest. We'll roll over to one side. Make our way all the way up to seated. And we'll gently bring our hands to our low belly, elbows out wide, closing the eyes. And just allowing any energy that we accumulated from this yoga class to be directed right into our belly. Visualizing healthy digestion. A nice balance of fire in the gut. And just giving thanks to all the hard work your digestive system does on a daily basis for you. And we'll bring the hands to heart center, bow the mind to the heart, and just thank yourself for being here today. Namaste. Thank you so much for joining me here. I'm Kim Goyette, your meditation mother. If you like this video and you want to be the first to receive weekly videos, please subscribe to my YouTube channel at Yoga with Meditation Mother. And if you want to learn about yoga retreats happening all around the world, please go to my website at www.meditationmutha.com. Thanks so much. See you next time. Mm -hmm.